Yo, yo, Karla Freta, my name is Ardolir, and today I'm going to show you guys how easy it is to create your own presets in Lightroom. All right, so welcome to Lightroom. You've made bunch of different adjustments. You're very, very happy and you want to create your own presets. Now, how you do that is very simple. All you have to do is just to go here to where you see presets and you see this plus sign, click it and go create presets. Here you are faced with some options. First, you have the name. You can name it whatever you like. We can name it that Icelandic guy is hot. Under that, you have the group. By default, it's in user presets. I'll go more into this in a second. And then you have the settings. Here you can choose what of the settings you want to be added in your preset. So you can have check all and have everything, or maybe you don't want your preset to affect the white balance. I never want my preset to affect the white balance because the white balance is different on each and every photo. So I uncheck that, and often I might uncheck other things. Sometimes I don't like my presets to have the gradient filters or radial filters, sometimes I like. So here you can basically have whatever settings you like to be added into your presets. It's very simple, okay? So you just add whatever you want to be in your preset. Then you click create. Now, your preset will be here in user preset and you should see it there. Do, 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 that Icelandic guy is hot. Now let's say you wanna create a group of presets cause you are creating your own preset pack. Very simple too. You go here to plus again, create preset. And then in the group, let name this first, that Icelandic guy is hot, hot. We can have it like this, hot, okay? And then in group, now we just create a new group. So you can go here new group and you can name this group this preset here let's just name it new preset a pack bam 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 and go create now we have the same thing here and you go create boom and then you should see here in the packs you should see here new preset pack and under there we have the preset all right now there are a few more things that is nice to know so don't turn off yet you can see here that let's say you are making a few changes you want the clarity on this one to go down you want this preset to be a little bit less saturated so we take down the saturation of this one and maybe add up the contrast just just something okay now you made changes to the preset what you can do then if you think this is nicer than your old preset you could go here and go boom and then update with current settings what happens now when you click that is this preset here will be updated with these settings, so it's, you're changing it. Maybe you thought, that, ah, this was better. Now you updated with these settings, and that's how you do that. If you wanna create another preset and add it in the pack, you basically just go boom, create preset, and make sure it's in the pack that we are creating. We can name this, uh, <laughs> that guy is how, how, uh, and then the, saturated or something, I don't know, you can create name them whatever you like and create a boom. Now, if you want to export your preset because you want to send them to your friends and family, because <laughs> that's what you do with presets or sell them or whatever you want to do, then you go here and right click on the preset, show in Explorer and a boom, you will get where they are. And these are XMP files. And you can basically just copy paste this to a new folder or just send these files right away. Let's take this down here. So that's it. That's how you create presets. It's very, very simple. It's in the plus sign. And if you didn't get it, you can rewind and watch the video again. And if you have any questions, as always, feel free to ask a comment down below. If you could smack that like button for me, it would really, really help me out. And you know, uh, is there anything more? I don't think so. I think, I think this was a great video. I had a lot of fun and I hope that you also had a lot of fun and we will see each other in the next video. I'm out. Peace.